He knows to be on the playoff path this year, the Cats are going to have to beat Arkansas this Saturday. And Bearcat Nation believes it's doable and hopes another special year is about to happen. You're looking at more than just a football coach. Luke Fickle is a larger-than-life figure around the UC campus, just four days before the new season starts on the road down south. I asked Fickle how he's prepared the Bearcats for the atmosphere in Fayetteville. It's not easy. You know, you could say, well, we, we pump music in and we, and we want it to be loud, but the reality is you, you want to have good practices. So I think there's a balance there. Fans will try to keep their balance in the bars along Short Vine and Calhoun in the coming weekends. These places will be packed again, in part due to the fickle factor. I went to all the games last year. It was, it was crazy to be in. Um, so... I mean, the energy, just to be in Nipper itself when the stadium is rocking, you can feel the stadium shake. It's, it's crazy. For home games this season, a portion of Short Vine will be blocked off. A stage and screen will be set up for a local version of game day. Here's Pickle on whether his players sense the vibe on the streets. I think they do. Uh, and, um, you know, there's something you don't want to get caught up in. I know that, uh, you know, it's something we're proud of. Fickle says he wants them to experience what it's like when there's a buzz on campus, and there's a definite buzz. So I've met him in person. Like, you, you can tell he has that, like, work ethic. Like, he's always, like, on the move and working. Fickle has a self-deprecating air about him, joking he's too busy to have friends. Part of the charm. He has a way of bringing you in, and once you get in there, you know, you're sold. Fickle has said he wants UC to not just be a top 10 team, but a top 10 program. And given turnover from last year, he acknowledges game one will test that. But then he adds, we define who we are. Fans certainly have a definition of who he is, someone they like a lot. John London, WWT News 5.